The story starts with the description of a river, and a crocodile, and then transitions into the description of a 12-year-old poor girl, Sabia. Though she was too poor to buy gems, or even blown glass beads, she loved to admire the various types of beads that were sold in a bazaar near the village. All the females in her village had different necklaces made from colorful glass beads. One day, Sabir, her mother and other women of the village went into the jungle to collect paper grass to be sold in the market. All the women were wearing various colorful necklaces, whereas Sabir had none. The river is full of deadly crocodiles, so the women make loud noises while crossing the stream because the noises scare the crocodiles away. They collect the paper grass and return back to the village, but Sabir lags behind intentionally to check the cave where she had kept her own handmade clay molded cups and saucers to dry. Sabia goes back into the jungle to get her grass, sickle and fork. The fork was lying near a rock, and while picking it up, she comes across a pretty blue bead. She plucks it out of water, and her joy you know bounce. A happy girl, she was returning home. On her way back, she comes across her mother, who's searching for her. She scolds her for being late, as she was afraid that something wrong might have happened to Sabia. In answer, Sabia narrates what actually happened and shows her mother the blue bead. 